Hi, welcome to Microman. Today we're going to be looking at a jumping spider. Now this was not a request, but a comment made by Ferrandoodle. Ferrandoodle said, jumping spiders are just cuter. And that was after another video I did about a different type of spider. And so I thought I might as well show Ferrandoodle what a jumping spider looks like under the microscope. So we're gonna take this guy and we're gonna look at him. So before we get under the microscope, I just wanted to say, if you find a jumping spider in your home, please don't kill it. Let it go. It Jumping spiders are one of the most friendly, docile spiders there is. And so if you find one, it's not going to bite you. The only real way to probably get these things to bite you is to force them to. So maybe holding it between two fingers and pressing down. But they're really friendly spiders. I've picked up bigger ones than this and some of those really big colorful ones. I've never been bit by them. They're really friendly spiders, plus they're great at pest control. And so it's a spider that won't bite you. So if it's in your home, let it go and see how friendly this guy is to me. He's not doing anything, just chilling. All right, let's get on the microscope. All right, so we are now under the microscope and we are up by the head and right away we see those eyes. Got the front two, one, two, three. And there's, let's check the other side here. Four. Now we see four eyes right at the front of the face. Now I wanna see the, the petty palps, which are used for grabbing and bringing food toward the mouth. These are not the fangs, but the they assist in bringing for food toward the mouth. And that's these here, the very hairy. The hair on these jumping spiders seems a lot longer than any other spiders we've looked at. at one of the legs. All the spiders we've checked always have this claw on the end of their foot. Let's see if he's got it. Yep, he does right there. A claw that's used to assist in climbing. This is kind of new. I haven't seen this before. You've got these little claws or spikes on the side of the legs. Again, here's another one of those spikes. That, that's another eye. This thing's got eyes on the side of its head. No wonder these things are such great hunters. Their eyes are, are completely surrounding the front of the face. So you have some on the side, you have them on the front here, and then there's another one there on the side. So these things have really good vision. That is, that is another thing. They do have really good vision so that they can catch prey and they Instead of running on the ground, they jump and pounce on their prey, so they have to have some really good accuracy. So that's pretty cool. I haven't seen a spider with the eyes on the side of the head like this. This hair, man. This hair. This looks like a, a hairy yeti. This guy is very hairy. And the hair looks smooth. thorax and go to the abdomen here. There's that white yeti hair.
There we go. Anyway, very hairy spider. you enjoyed looking at this guy please comment and subscribe to support the channel and let me know what you would like to see under the microscope now i'm gonna let this guy go and again please subscribe and thanks for watching all right buddy it's time to let you go here we go oh whoa 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 you're going the wrong way come on buddy I know we've been through a lot, but it's time to go home. Come on. <laughs> All right, buddy. What are you doing? Come on. There you go. Up you jump. There you go. Oh, there he is. Very nice. Okay, he's free. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.